right so I've got this new camera um, and I thought I'd bring it into the workshop to give it a try out I'm gonna, I am going to have a little go at a bit of a project today um, if you keep seeing me look this way it's because I'm, I've got one of them cameras where you can uh, use your phone as a viewfinder um, and for some reason I keep feeling the need to look at it even though the camera's not moving uh, I keep feeling the need to look at the uh, phone to check them in frame and what have you so I'm not sure what the quality of the sound is like I don't know what the picture is going to be like so I'm hoping it's going to be decent enough it was only a very cheap camera I think I paid 55 quid for it from Asda um, I'll give it a go see what we can do okay so what I want to do today is I want to try another lamp um, I've seen so many versions of lamps online and I think they're brilliant I just really enjoy making them um, this time I'm going to use a uh, jar usual copper piping and I've got this plate thing this is something I tested ages ago so I thought I'd uh, make use of it but I've got this plate it's from an old light fitting but as you can see it kind of needs uh, a good clean up and I think this time what I'm going to try instead of leaving it a bit dirty and what I do, I'm going to clean the copper pipe up uh, get it a little bit more shinier uh, might try and do it with a bit of vinegar or something is it vinegar that cleans it? Oh, we're going to find out aren't we and I think I'm either going to mount it all onto either a bit of oak or a bit of mahogany because that's what I've got right so what I'm going to do is I'm going to attempt to solder this part to this part like that more or less and that in turn will eventually lead me to well basically that so I've not done a lot of soldering in the past, so let's give it a go, see how we get on. Ooh, this stuff doesn't feel so good at the minute. It's a bit hard. Well, I've got it soldered, I think. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to leave it to cool down and uh, see how we get on after this bit. I think the next part I'm going to do is try and clean up the metal a bit and maybe make it look a bit nicer. Okay, so for the um, lid portion of the jar, there is actually a design on the on the lid that I don't really want part of 
my overall job so what I'm going to do is I'm just going to give it a quick flash over with some I think it's matte black spray paint <laughs> Um, no, I know you should prime it and all of that, but I haven't got any, so this will have to do. And of course, <coughs> this should really be done in a ventilated area, but it's very windy outside and I really didn't want to get anything stuck to my paint. So I'm just going to leave that aside to dry and move on. So moving on, um, while things are drying and cleaning, um, moving on to the next part of my project. Um, I'm recycling a bulb holder, um, but I think it looks a bit, well, not so good, white. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to spray paint it black as well to match the lid. Uh, it'll get a new wire. The bulb holder is okay because I tested it before I stripped it out of the lamp. Uh, it'll get a new wire, so what I'm going to do is I'm just going to use that as an handle while I paint it. Again, really, you should do painting in a ventilated area, but as I said, it's too windy. I'm probably going to have to come back and give these items another coat, but oh, I will if I keep dropping it. But you know, it's okay. So yeah, it's probably a bit more of a heavier coat than I'd want to do, but um, I think it's made it look better already. Right, um, I've been scrubbing like mad at this, I don't know if it's brass or what, um, but I just can't get it clean. So what I've decided to do is I've I want to keep the copper as copper so I've decided to mask it off and I guess to soak the lid and the lamp holder I'm just going to spray the plate black. Again I've got no undercoat for it so it'll have to, it'll have to do I'm afraid. Hmm. I quite like that actually. Uh, may have to give it another coat. Well, I've missed a bit completely there, but I may have to give it another coat, but we'll see.